Hey guys, you ever been out camping, glamping, off grid, and needed some power? Today, we're going to be reviewing the Predator 3500 watt from Harbor Freight. Stick around. All right, guys, welcome back. Like I said, we will be going over this Predator 3500 watt. It's a generator slash inverter. It says it's super quiet. It'll run up to 11 hours on two and a half gallons, which is pretty impressive. I have to say so myself that I will be doing a couple things to this before I put this into production. And that will be swapping out the spark plug. And, oh, that's nice. It comes with that. So it's not the spark plug. And I'm going to uh, break the motor in. <clears throat> Two hour run. I'm going to change the oil or start it up, get the oil in it. I'm going to change the oil in it at two hours. And then I do have a metal spark, or metal spark plug. I have a magnet oil plug coming in, which should be here tonight, but I am not home. So there's that. So this thing comes with its own little funnel that's kind of cattywamped right now, just for the simple fact that it was smashed in the box I did. Happened to go get my own funnel. And I will be putting mobile synthetic in at 1030 after we're done doing the test. Maybe before because it didn't say if it came with anything. It does come with a 30 amp twist lock RV adapter. There you go. Move your finger tie. There. <clears throat> of course, instructions on how to work a generator. And then the giant generator itself. Which, what is nice on this that I did not know it came with, is this one has a fuel gauge on it. It has a gauge, so that's a plus. It's in the bag. <clears throat> Sounds like tools. This come with a Phillips head and a flat head. That's kind of neat. Let's see what else is in here. <laughs> For a spark plug which that's nice and a nice little carrying case that comes with it all right so on tag you have in front it just has instructions how to start it using here here and here this is for your battery i'm actually going to use their little tool that they provide to see how good it does it's for your battery connect actually has a pretty nice little case here but what I'm going to do, I know this is for the battery, but what I'm going to do is take the side panel off. Because I'm going to have to get to the spark plug anyway. Decent little panel on the side. Take that off pops out so it has two screws and on the side little pop outs and at the bottom you have a little nippies to go on there Come on. So that's a battery tray. Full volt battery. This is for the electric start. And before I do this, I'm actually going to... Nice little battery it comes with. Before I set that up, I'm going to change the spark plug. Let's 
All right, so the spark plug that came with it, it's called a Torch F6 RTC, which we're going to be put, replacing it with an Iridium NGK plug. Fill it with oil because they do not come pre-oiled. So it's just keep using what was given. So they say to fill this up to the line on the inside, which is full. Can't believe I'm using synthetic to break in a freaking motor, but that's fine. All right, so now that we got the battery in, oil in, spark plug in, we're gonna let this run for an hour. We wanna break the motor in. We wanna do it the right way. So we're gonna let it run for an hour, change the oil. That is super quiet. Wow. What a design. That's probably the quietest generator I've ever seen in my life. Wow. All right, so what we're gonna do now is turn it off. cool down then we're going to change the oil all right guys well that's going to do it for this one uh what we did we went over Put a new spark plug in the 3500 watt Predator, super quiet. We uh, broke in the motor, two hour break in, changed the oil. I'm gonna do it again in 16 hours, maybe less, just to try to make sure everything got out what was in it. But uh, stick around. I'm gonna have that hooked up to the cabin here, the off-grid cabin. Um, but yeah, as always for me, stay at the ready. Oh, you can get this Predator generator at Harbor Freight. I'm pretty sure you can get them on Amazon. I'll put the link somewhere or whatever. But as for me, as always, stay at the ready, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Out.